Hi there, ladies and gentlemen. Ken Alexander coming to you for IloveItSpicy.com, and we have got a great review for you today. We're going to talk about Tabanero Hot Sauce Picante. You can see the label there, and I'm just going to cut to the chase. I love this sauce. A lot of things I love about this sauce, and we're going to talk about them. All right, so let me tell you a little bit about Tabanero. It comes out of it. The, they get their peppers from the Tabasco region of Mexico down in the Yucatan Peninsula. It's a habanero-based sauce. Tabanero, get it? So it has nothing to do with another very world-known um, uh, table-based hot sauce. Uh, it has to do with the region of Mexico where they get their peppers. Started in a journey in 2007. That was a region that they had, were all set to go to market, found this great source of peppers. They had a massive flood. So they had to wait a few years, but finally got it to market. And one of the things that I'm gonna tell you now I like about this sauce is they give a proceed, uh, a portion of their proceeds to a church in Tabasco, Mexico, all right, for their relief and their community effort. So these guys have a great heart out of Boca Raton, Florida. Other things I like about this sauce, and I'm gonna tell you what's in it in a second. You get an eight ounce bottle for a five ounce price. It's a great table sauce. I'm gonna tell you a little bit about what's in this sauce and what's not. Select habanero peppers, so they're picky about their peppers. Carrots, very common for a habanero sauce, complements well. Onions, key lime juice, so you get that sweet citrusy kind of feel, tartness from the key lime. Agave, that's a very smooth sweet uh, to kind of smooth out a habanero heat, which they do beautifully. Garlic salt and grapefruit seed extract to give another little, just a, a dimension of flavor to hit your palate and hit your palate it does, and it does a wonderful job. I don't care what you're using it with. It's a medium consistency sauce, I think, and probably the only thing, as you can see, it kind of going in with that nice, rich orange flavor. It takes a little bit to shake out. Smooth. Mild, and that's the only exception I take with it, is they list this as a medium to hot on their label. Um, and it's not. It's a mild sauce, at least for me. Now, for somebody that's going to the grocery store looking for a sauce, it may be a medium sauce to them, but for a chili head or anybody that's used to hot sauce, it's a mild. But it's okay. It is so flavorful, so robust, all natural, no vinegar, so incredibly smooth heat. This is a brilliant hot sauce. This is a four and a half flaming hard hot sauce for Ken Alexander four and a half flaming hearts. And if you've caught any of my reviews in the past, you know that that's not a review that I would hand out often, hardly at all. A four flaming heart review is huge for me, so to get four and a half is almost perfection, almost a perfect sauce. So I'm gonna tell you, you can get this at tabanero.com. The more you buy, the less expensive it is. It's an eight ounce bottle, so you get more for your money. You can also get it at iburn.com. They're a distributor for this product as well. Tell them, um, I love it spicy sent you. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, Tabanero Hot Sauce, Ken Alexander, I love it spicy.com, and most importantly, never forget, it's a fiery world. Have a great day.